the wonder of Theo is that I don't know what you're going to say from minute to minute. Okay. I don't know when you're and on stage. I, do? I don't know what you're going to say. You're going to so I so the my point is I don't know what you know. Mm-hmm. I have no idea what you know. Okay. You get, as I told you, you you do in your act, you look like a guy who who has matches, right? Yep, I believe that. You look like uh if if I could be anywhere in the world, if you text me and said I'm outside, I would believe it. Okay, I respect that. I would that. come and get like just yep. That Theo's outside. That makes any fucking anywhere in the world. I got to go to get Theo. What we're at the United Nations. He's outside. He's outside. Man. He said he's outside. Yeah, I gotta, yeah, gotta okay, go. I believe that. So I don't know what. So that. the question is, I don't know what you know, and I feel like you know. I know you know more than I think you know. Okay, but I don't know what the breadth of the knowledge is okay so we're gonna play a game show called what does theo know i want you to play along at home maybe you'll throw some music underneath this some game show music um play along at home what does theo know and do i, I just have, tell you things uh no i'm gonna ask you questions and what and then people will guess whether you know it or not all right okay and i'm gonna guess too yeah you will you will tell us i'll tell you if i think you know You'll mm-hmm. weigh in. Mm-hmm. He knows. <laughs> you know what he knows? I think I know, but I don't know what you know. Yeah, no one knows what Theo knows. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's do it. Name five members of the 1985 Chicago Bears. Ooh. I believe you know this. You almost don't because of your age, but I believe you can muscle it out. All right, I'm going to go with your boy, um, uh, Sean Gale, who murdered oh, his wife. you fucking know. Then if you know Sean Gale... <laughs> But I know that because I'm a Dateline fanatic. Okay. Uh, outside of that, I'm going with your boy. Oh, I will go with this. Uh, uh, the quarterback, that legend, Jim uh, McMahon. Okay. Who I met at a golf tournament out in Palm Springs, and he had this little kind of thick Jewish woman as his girlfriend, and she said he he goes, this lady will always eat my butt. That's what he told me, which was kind of <laughs> crazy, I thought. The, that's the sort of thing I expected you to know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> And bro, I watched him drink eighteen beers, man, at this. Golf yeah, tournament. that guy's a wild. He's yeah, wild. Bro. Yeah, he's, and he would stand up when he would say that about the lady, and he would kind of he had pants on. He was like kind of pull his butt apart, which was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and I think I got high with them actually, but um, <laughs> but anyway, so Sean Gale, uh, Sean Gale, I don't know if was on that team. That he might have been after that team, but I'll give you Sean Gale and I'll okay. absolutely Jim McMahon. And I'm going to go with your boy Richard Dent right there. Richard Dent. Yeah, if you know Richard Dent, then you're going to get And I'm going to go with Sweetness, Walter Payton. Yep, we're up to four. And I'm going to go with, um, of course, who else is it? It's that guy, uh, Refrigerator Perry. Yeah. Keep going. Who else do you know? Sean Gale, the killer right there. Uh, who yep, else? he was on the team. Yeah, He was. I believe he returned kickoffs. I believe he returned his wife to heaven too, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah, Roni Reuter. Willie Galt returned for them. Oh, Willie Galt. Willie Remember Galt. Him? Yeah, goddamn. Dude, black people used to have more, much more kind of old school names, I feel like. Yeah, they had like, it was before the apostrophes and the quans and the. Yeah, Willie Galt, you know. Yeah, uh, they had like southern, they had like. Uh, 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 sharecroppers names yeah they had definitely like holdover like second third hand kind of yeah names like that like i remember like uh you'd meet a guy named lilac or something like that and you'd be like that is a cr-, you know l-i-l-l-i-l-a-c yeah like the like the flower yes or toby like, um, yeah or toby yeah uh, to, all right toby's a little too toby's far a little right. toby i can't get i can't and you doesn't even know i can't endorse that name ken theo von name Four films directed by Spike Lee. I think you can. I don't think I can, but I'm going to do it. Um, I'm going to say. Audience, think about your answer before he begins. First of all, I don't like Spike Lee. Okay. So. That's why I picked him. He's a, he's a, he's a political I think he just looks like shit. I don't care about the direct. I mean, I, yeah, some of the movies are whatever. I mean, I liked definitely White Men Can't Jump and Poetic Justice. He was not involved in either of them. Are you he, serious? He not got even, game. He wasn't even in close to them. Were you um, thinking he got game with Denzel? That was uh-uh. Spike Lee. I was thinking about White Men Can't Jump. With White Men Can't Snakes. Jump. You're thinking of he got game. You're thinking of 
Yeah, I don't like, I just think Wesley Snipes is overrated. That's what I mean. I shouldn't say yeah. I don't like him. I shouldn't say he looks like shit. I just, you know, he looks like somebody that fucking managed a, like a, uh, like one of those places at the Dave and Buster's where you go cash in the tickets. He looks like the dude that managed that for like 40 <laughs> years. And then I just don't think he made that much good stuff. What did he make? You, so that's, you can't, you, that's, you, you could that's not it. answer. No, that's Interesting. It. Okay. All right. That's the, I, Figure there might be a limit there, but I'm surpri- but I'm still surprised. Oh well, Mac- Malcolm 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 X. You ever oh, seen Malcolm Jungle X? Fever. I haven't seen Malcolm X. Malcolm X. I've seen the movie. original one. Yeah, that's yeah. Oh, that's, it is. But yeah, from like ninety one. Oh yeah, that one. That's good. Spike. Wow. Yeah. Uh, Black Klansman. Did you see that? No. I didn't see it either. Um, Jungle Fever. She's got to have it. Uh, mm, a lot of L's, blues. bro. He t- yeah, I mean, he started taking L's pretty regularly. I just think he's overrated. I'm sure he's probably a neat guy. Yeah, 25th Hour, people like that movie. I didn't like that movie. Bamboozled. He got game. He got game. You know what's great about He Got Game? It's just watching Ray uh, Allen shoot. Really? So it's Ray Allen plays like a college basketball phenom. Yeah. And there's scenes where him and Denzel are arguing, and Ray Allen's shooting jumpers. And he makes like nine in a row from three at one point, but it's in the it's in a scene and there's no edits, right? And it's fucking you never see someone shoot like that, like it's fucking cr- it's crazy because you just see a guy just make where you're like, are you, you know, you ever watch like Steph uh, Steph oh, Curry yeah. videos where he's just like, and you're like, this is weird, yeah, like feels he's electric, haunted, electronics, yeah, like yeah, like he might be a witch, like that's haunted what the, by a video game, yeah. This one I think you will get, all right. Name three people who have served as governor of California. Oh, Gavin Newsom. Mm -hmm. Uh, Sonny, uh, son, uh, I know this. I can't believe you're about to say who you're going to say. Really? I can't believe that you, because I didn't even remember this one. I don't know if I remember, but let me think. Uh, uh, Reed, I think his name was, Sunshine Brown. Uh. Mm. Sunshine, Jerry? Was a, yes, Jerry Sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> Sunshine was like his nickname. Yeah, Sunshine, Jerry, Jerry, <laughs> Jerry Brown. Uh huh. Wow. And uh, oh, Villaraigosa, and uh, Antonin Villaraigosa. No, I don't think he was governor. It wasn't. Oh, oh, Arnold he was Schwarzenegger. Mayor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I, those were the ones I thought you would get. I thought you might get Pete Wilson. They were, nope. There was a second governor of. He's really old, but his his name was Sonny James. Did you Rolf. mean Sonny Jim Rolf? <laughs> no, I did not. Even though that See, guy. Be honest. Did you mean Sonny Jim Rolf? <laughs> no, that guy looks like he definitely has your. He would get sunburned. He does. He would have to wear leather driving gloves if he drove my family around. Look at that mustache. What man. a mustache! That's a goddamn. Um, all right, question number four. Theo, what is it? And do you think Theo knows the answer? Does Theo know what a carburetor is and does? Yes. Yes, he does. <laughs> Go. I'm going to say. I think he does. You think so? Yeah. This is the sort of thing I expect you to know. But if you told me you didn't, I because you're. A carburetor, yeah. I feel like. I feel like a carburetor takes heat off of the engine. What do you think, Nick? I have no idea. Does it have smoke in it? I'm looking at it. Carburetor. That carburetor. I like that you're trying to think of the times you've heard it. People talk about it. Yeah. A carburetor is a (laughs) device that mixes air and fuel for internal combustion engines and the proper fuel. Yeah, I don't know. (laughs) That carb. You got to use that carb. And look what they call it in Australia. You'll like this. What? A carby. A carby. Of course, because it's Australia. <laughs> they put a Y on the back of everything. <laughs> I met a guy from Australia the other day. Um, that carby. Yeah, so carburetor. All right, so that, I bet a lot of people are surprised you didn't know. Because I didn't really know. And I still don't even, now that I know what it is, I'm like, I don't really know what that is. It feels like it's part of the engine. Yeah, it sounds like it is. That carburetor, boy. It is part of the engine, but... I don't. I the, let's not count that one. 
Oh, I'm counting it. Okay, count it. So you <laughs> did know the Bears. You didn't know Spike Lee. You did know California. You did not know what a carburetor is. Okay. Here's one. Okay. Will Theo know what AIDS is an acronym for? I think you will. I'm going to go with autoimmune deficiency syndrome. That is correct. I believe it's acquired immune, but it might be autoimmune. Yeah, Either one right. is right. <clears throat> Nick? Acquired, but autoimmune is fine. Do you, uh, have, did you ever think you had, had AIDS and got tested for it? No. I mean, other people think I have it. Really? Um, I mean, look at me. Um, I've never think AIDS. No, I know. <laughs> the AIDS, like something lesser, like no, HIV. No. <laughs> like you're not full blown AIDS. I would think maybe that you had a neighbor <laughs> that had polio. That's what I would think, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I never. No, but you remember having sex in the '90s? Oh, it yeah. It was like a. It was you. It was scary. It was. You oh, there was definitely really a fear. Think yeah. about it. Like. Really think about AIDS more than I think about STDs now. You would think, "Am I gonna die from this?" Oh, I remember being so angry at somebody when I was young that I told people they had AIDS. Mm. Mm. How old? <laughs> oh, man, <laughs> like high grade school, high school. Now that I sound it out, probably <laughs> <laughs> graduate school. Probably twenty nine. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Were they? It's uh, not we funny, bro. Know, I don't want to know any follow-ups. I don't want to know any more. It's not. Did funny. they have? Did they ever confront you about it? Huh? No, nah, man. It's not funny, and I hope that they're doing good too. Okay. I believe you're gonna know this. Name two books by Ernest Hemingway. Oh, I know this one. What did the audience think? He kind of told me. I would. I would have guessed yes. I think he knows literature quite a bit, actually. Yeah. I hear some some crazy references pulled out. And I'm going to go with Sun Also Rises uh -huh. and Moby Dick. Heifer. He did not write Moby Dick. I had the Are same. Are you serious? Yeah, I had the same thought. And I can't remember who wrote Moby did Dick. Did one of his friends write it? Who wrote it? Oh, man, I can't even remember either. It is Herman Melville. Oh. Do you want a what third? Do you want to guess a different one? <laughs> Hemingway? No, I just knew that one they had us write, read in high school, Ernest Hemingway. I never really liked Hemingway, man. I thought it was good. I think Muriel's pretty hot, but I never. I haven't read any of it. You haven't? No. It was always a little. I don't know. Short. I like the short sentences. He stuff. was like mm -hmm. super into like outdoorsy guy shit, right? Yeah, he hunted and stuff. Like was he really? And yeah, yeah. Boats and he, and, and he, he was, was a like soldier. Cameron Haynes, basically. Yeah. <laughs> This is kind of early Cameron Haynes, I guess. Um, All right. We did not. I'm surprised. Sorry, folks. He did not know. This one I think you're going to know. Name three songs. Can you name three songs by Def Leppard? Let me think about it. Def Leppard? <laughs> uh huh. I would say. Uh, it's not Def Leppard. Um. No, fuck. I oh. would have guessed you did. I would have guessed you I, did. I was gonna say cherry pie. That's what I was gonna say. That's oh. warrant. That's warrant. Yeah, that's warrant, bro. I fucking love warrant. <laughs> uh, here we got the old man in the sea for whom the bell tolls. That's those are not Def Leppard songs. Those are <laughs> that is uh, that is Hemingway books. In our time, sun also rises. Farewell to arms, to have and have not. For whom the bell tolls, the old man. Of the Good city. evening, good afternoon, and other times. Thanks for watching that video you just saw. I mean, it was okay. But the next video you could watch could be way better. What if you watch a video right now that changes your life? Well, you could. Watch this one. Or watch this one. Watch this one. Watch this one. Watch this one. Ah!